This week's shop is located 1 minute and 17 seconds out in uh, Ossie Osborne's Crazy Train. Uh, and this is a phrase uh, where I encourage you to find your own solution as to whether you pick or use legato. I have not thoroughly analyzed how Rand Rose played it uh, and I feel that my own solution both feels and sound a bit clumsy and I think I could have used more legatos to get a better flow through it. But done is done. Uh, we're starting out, uh, it's in um, an F sharp minor pentatonic. <laughs> Uh, fingering one, box one, whatever you want to call it. So we're starting out on the third string on the um, ring finger, the fourth fret of the third string, and we bend it. And then you proceed to the second string, uh, second fret with the with the index finger, and you play twice. Like that. So you get. You then go to the pinky on the fifth fret of the second string, pick it, and you do a pull off back to the index finger. And then you go to the middle finger, and you pull off. So uh, the start is like this. Three, four. You then proceed to the 5th uh, fret of the 3rd string with the pinky and you go back to the 2nd fret of the 2nd string and then yet again back to the 5th fret of the 3rd string and then you go 4th fret and 2nd fret with the ring and the index finger respectively So, uh, so far we got this And from here you proceed to the 4th fret of the 4th string and you alternate and go back to the index finger and then yet again to the 4th string. And then you just do the same thing but starting on the 2nd fret of the 4th string and go to the 4th fret of the 5th string. So what you add including the last note in the previous sequence is this. And if we put that together, we got it so far. Three, Then proceed to the third fret of the fifth string with the middle finger and to the index finger with a pull off and to the fifth fret of the sixth string with the pinky. So, what you add to what we just played is this. So, I'm gonna play it a couple of times, all of it. Three. And then you go back to the first fret, uh, second fret of the fifth string and you do a drill. And then you go to the fifth fret again with the sixth string. Like this. So, and it's hard to do slowly, but the, um, uh, I think that the index finger, the last note, is supposed to be 
on the fourth sixteen note before the next beat. So it's going to be three, four. Something like that. And that's the entire shot. And I'm gonna play through it four times slowly. One, two, That's it for this week.